do 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 it's recording, but we're not really doing anything yet, because I'll cut out this part in the next part of this whole video. That's video editing for years. Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Michael West, and my nephew comes running into the room, so I have to totally restart that. Okay. <laughs> hey everybody, it's Michael West, how are you doing today? Today I am joined with my bestest buddy on Hard Survival, Crash Test Flan. Yo. And today what we're going to go ahead and show you is the new, improved TU-14 and TU-15 updated version of my spawn trap. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and show you around it a little bit and then we're going to run through the spawn trap. As you can tell, we've totally abandoned our armors. We are unarmored. We are as weak naked and snack. fleshy as you. Yes, naked. <laughs> All right. So in this video, this is going to be the one and only video that I'm going to be showing you how to get out of the spawn trap as well. So any of you poor, poor, poor bastards who happen to be joining my map when I leave friends of friends option on, this is how you get out. Now, as you can see, there is a button. It will open the door. Jumping will do you no good at all. Then the regular spiel of Welcome to Caveat Emptor, better known as Buyer Beware. My PSN is Fubar Medic, and you can see my YouTube at the video that you're currently watching, of course. Um, and the griefing spawn trap, that's what this motherfucker is. If you destroy it, if you cause any damage to it, I'll kick you! This is the litmus test to see how much of an asshole you are and if I want you to play on my map anyways. So, we're gonna go ahead and run through this. It's all nice, prettied up, got flower pots. Come up here. Jumping suggested and accessing the that entire waterway is gonna be covered in lava. Good luck, jerk face. So, after entering this little luxury cottage thing that I decided to make up in my spawn trap, you go ahead and come in here, there are two redstone lamps. I totally told Bloody Shoot it was two redstone lamps, you can see this in this video. I'm not trying to be jerk, buddy. Very nice. What you go ahead and do is, go ahead, left redstone lamp, there's a button right underneath it. You whack it one time. Woohoo, you said almost furry. Not all Walk right yet. outside of the spawn trap. Get past the iron golem. Of course, get past the iron golem. You're supposed to walk into this little secret door, by the way, for you poor bastards that are unfortunately stuck in my spawn trap. I have given you some yeah, yeah, villagers. Enjoy Much all of that. So we enter through the spawn trap door. I'll go down first. Door behind you. Click. Uh oh, uh oh, the drowning. Is that the exit? I almost did myself. Oh, I went into one of the, uh, the side tunnels for the water. Yes, you do go down fast, pal. All right. So Very here welcoming we are. side here. Oh man, heart survival is the best. All right, so since I forgot to turn it on before, TNT explodes is now activated. Ooh, I wonder what ingredient of a spawn trap would require TNT being explosive. Ooh, well, yeah, we'll go ahead and start we'll navigating through here. All right, let's work our way through. Oh crap! Oh, you got to be kidding me already! <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> wow. wow. I'm the winner. <laughs> Once you get past this marvelous little minefield set via tripwire traps, and by the way, varying times when I rebuilt this trap, again, all done in hard survival, I add more or put in less TNT at varying times. Depending on how unfortunate you may or may not be, you may run into absolutely no TNT in a giant hole in the ground, or a ocean of TNT and you'll fall into lava. Yeah. But basically, once you've done that, you walk over here along this fencing, you flip that switch, and the exit door is nice and open for you. You've escaped! Welcome to Caveat Emptor! I hope it was worth it. I had eight levels, man. Yeah, well, I have 27, so at least I didn't die. <laughs> and 
and unlock the door on your ass. That's what you get for having to run the trap again. Hopefully you can get past that hole. Of course you can get the trap. It's amazing. I wonder if it blew up all of the TNT. Yeah, it did. Good Most of it did blow up. Yeah. Oh shit! Okay. Whew. I fell in. I didn't fall into death. Oh, good luck getting out of that part. Uh, I know how to get out of here. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? I have fucking all of the fire resistance <laughs> armor, and you all thought me a fool. That exactly. So that so everyone knows this is still recording. There's my boots of ownage, my super pants, my unnamed, you know, diamond chest plate, and my pimp cap. Yeah. I don't have Pone Star, my epic sword on me. All right, let's try to shitty parkour my way out. Whee! Oh, this is gonna end bad. All right, I'm on fire, but I hear I'm not... shut up. I'm I'm on fire. I'm not taking. You're gonna see this video, and you're gonna be like, oh shit, he should have died, but he didn't, and I'm all sad because I I'm not as cool. Cause this is all gonna be in it. Cause I'm already not on fire anymore. Uh -huh, I'm the winner. All right. Basically, you come down here once you get your rail cart from that supply, Maybe and that's the harder. video. <laughs> Yay! I hope you enjoyed it. That's the upgraded spawn trap, more or less, all blown up. All you guys have a good welcome. one. All visit, yes, exactly. All visitors welcome. Friends of friends on from here on out. Come on and join. Maybe not like that. You're a good listener. I like you. <laughs>